Hi, and welcome to Sleep Like a Boss Business. So today I want to talk about niche, to niche or to not to niche. And it's one of my favorite topics to talk about because my niche is sleep. It's very particular. But what I see a lot of the time happening is that people go way too vague and way too big of a number of people they want to target with their business. So currently, apart from being the CEO and founder of Sleep Like a Boss and mentoring private clients for business coaching, especially online entrepreneurs in the health and personal development sector, I'm also running a mastermind together with my friend Kendra Perry. And a lot of the people in there, pretty much all of them run online health businesses. And when we started, we did an audit of their websites. And what we discovered is that pretty much all of them had way too vast of a target audience. So in their copy, which is basically the text that is on their website, it would say things like, I can help you with stress, fatigue, bloating, migraines, thyroid, Lyme disease, um, joint pain, energy, lack of energy, brain fog, sleep issues, digestive issues, you name it. These things don't work. When someone gets to your website and they see all of that stuff, it sounds an alarm bell. It's this too much. How can they deliver on all of these things? It either means that they're not good at anything in particular or they're just shooting their horn way too much and it's just a scam. So that doesn't work. The other thing is that people get overwhelmed, especially if you are in the health sector or in any sector whatsoever. People have tons of stuff going on around them and they have a very, very short attention span. So if they actually need to figure out if they are a good client for you, they are going to drop it. They are going to go and Google again and click on the next website where it's clearly speaking to them. Now, Yes, it is scary to go from a list of 10 things that you can help with to one because our brain is telling us, well, you are eliminating all of those people that you could help. True. But as an online entrepreneur, don't forget that your main reference or person referral partner is going to be Google. That's just the way it is. And Google wants things to be specific and you want to feed it information so that people type in their niche problem with whatever leading to you. So what I mean by that is don't forget how many people there are in the world. I could call myself a life and health coach because, yeah, I help with sleep, but I also help with digestion, with fatigue, all of the things that I mentioned before. But I get all my clients because I'm very niched and I get more than enough of them because there is hundreds, thousands, millions of people dealing with sleep issues. You just have to trust in that. And you know, especially if you had an issue yourself, you know there's huge communities out there. So don't feel that you're limiting yourself. The other thing is that when you create your content, you can still use all the other things that you know you can help with, but link them to your niche. So for me, it's thyroid and sleep. Another blog post would be parasites and sleep. Another blog post is minerals and sleep. Another blog post is bloating and sleep. So that is going to drive traffic to you from your niche, you're going to have people landing at your website. They're going to be, oh my God, this person is reading my mind. This is exactly for me. I want to talk to them. That's how it's done. If you need more help with this, if you have no clue how to do this, please reach out and consider business mentoring. I'm not someone who's going to sell you on a year-long program with me. I really believe in laser-focused coaching for a shorter time where we actually get shit done. (laughs) All right. I'll talk to you next week. And if you want to reach out, send me a message or email me at christine at sleeplikeaboss.com.